So this is production here. After inheriting Kern's kitchen in the 1970s from his grandparents, Walter and Leadra, Alan Roop has been in charge of making the official Kentucky Derby pie. You see Tom over there trimming shells. And each year he does it with the same team of only five full-time employees and volunteers from the community. Derby pie is a secret recipe. Because when it comes to making this chocolate nut pie, Every step has to be the same. We're very hands-on. Uh, you know, I think a lot of people think we've got this massive automated factory. We don't. We've got people doing the jobs, and we've got people eyeing the pie, and everything we do is around the quality of the pie. So we want every pie going out of here uh, as close to possible or as the same as when Grandma used to bake two at a time out at her prospect kitchen. And there you have it. A perfect derby pie, just like how Grandma Leandra used to make it. And the taste, just as good. So good that Roop says they have to increase production drastically during derby season just to fill the orders. They normally make 800 pies a day, but since last month, Roop and his team have been working six days a week, making 18 to 2,400 pies a day. I kind of referenced back in the 60s when the grandparents were doing it out of their home kitchen. You know, we're baking as many pies in a day as they did in a whole year back in those days. And he doesn't plan on stopping anytime soon. Doesn't feel like five, five decades. That's a lot of fun. That's a lot of fun getting out here and working hard and, and uh, getting things done. In Jefferson Town, Minaj Kungwari, WLKY News.